Okay, here we are in Heartside. And we have sweet little, beautiful little poodle babies. Mm -hmm. And these are from Chloe and Desi. And so Chloe is a Pecot Sable, super sweet mama. And Desi is a like red chocolate mom. Depends. If you're talking Australian Shepherds, they call it boss a red mom. Poodles, he was classified as chocolate mom. Huh. So back down. He kind of looks like Desert Storm Camel, so that's mm -hmm. where he gets his name. Okay, so we're going to start with each one of these little babies, just kind of from the top of the page, how they're listed on our website. So we got Betty Lou up at the very top. Betty Lou already has a home. She's going to Olivia in Virginia. And this is, okay, so they were born April 11, and today is May 28. In two days, on May 30th, they will be seven weeks old. And this little girl is the smallest. And today she weighs two pounds, five ounces. So there. <laughs> Olivia wanted me to leave her little. She didn't want me to do the poodle face on her. So there's little baby Betty Lou. That's her name for now. Okay, so then her sister right here is little Earlene. Not definite on her new name yet either. She's going to Derek. Well, to his friend, we'll see you. But uh, out in California, yes, it's little baby Arlene. Oh, do 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 see yes. <laughs> um, okay, baby Arlene weighs two pounds eight ounces, so she's just right at the two and a half pound mark. Yeah. Oh, wait, next, please. I have to tell you now, Desi is like he's the top of the miniature. He's fifteen inches tall. Weighs about 17 pounds. He's big. And Chloe is, you know, a nice medium miniature poodle. I mean, she's not real big, mm -hmm. but she is a definite miniature poodle. But Chloe has smaller on her, and so does Desi. So these guys, I'm calling them miniatures, but they're not going to be big miniatures. Okay, so the next one we have is Mr. Dodge. Now, you know silvers, they start out black, but, okay, Chloe's mother is a silver. Muffin is a silver. And this little guy is, he's going to turn silver, okay? And he's our big guy. Yes. He's going to be definite, nice miniature size poodle. Three pounds, ten and a half ounces. Mm. You can tell. He's, he's in the three pounds. Biggie. Yeah, he's Mr. Big Guy. Oh, he's a happy little boy. He's a sweet little boy. <laughs> okay, so I did the poodle hair haircut on him, at least on his old face. Now, what is interesting is he's also got some phantom markings. You know, he's got the little tans on his cheeks, and he's got a little bit right there on the eyebrows. And so, yeah, he's he's got some unique coloring going on here. They were all sleeping. Now, look at everybody's busy. Okay, okay. Okay, now, um, this one right here is Roscoe because I gave Roscoe the poodle cut, okay? And Roscoe is two pounds, nine ounces. So he's just <laughs> one ounce larger than her name. And he's a little bit uh, darker merle than, say, his brother. Nope, 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 nope. Okay. Well, I guess in the back they look about the same on his face, I think. Different. Little banjo looks a little lighter than mm -hmm. Kind of wider legs. But let's talk about... Roscoe. No, yeah, Roscoe. This is Roscoe. Okay. Now, you see, I like to use a comb. You can have... This is combination comb. It's got the small and the big. It's an older one. You can tell it's got a few. A little cheek missing. Cause we use our combs. Come here, baby. So, um, but you gotta be careful, of course, because you don't want to poke anybody in the eyes. And when you do a poodle face, the way my grooming books taught me, go from the corner of the eye to the middle of the ear. Corner of the eye, back to the middle of the ear. Oh, and then if you're going to cut the hair back here, you kind of make a line between this edge of the ear across to this edge. You can either come to a point or you can just do a curve. 
So, but the style these days, more and more often, people are wanting to just keep that little puppy face. I kind of bristle. I like my poodle faces. So, there's cute little baby Roscoe. <laughs> sweet, sweet. Okay, so, you, here's Mr. Banjo. Okay, baby banjo, let's see how much you weigh. Baby banjo weighs two pounds thirteen. So he's getting close to three pounds. Honest, a few ounces, you can tell the difference. See they have a little bit of this reddish shading in there. But he's got some nice moral markings. Oh, I tell you what, these all these puppies are gorgeous. They're absolutely gorgeous. Um, Mama has all sorts of different colors behind her, and so does Daddy. Yep, both parents are champions. We showed Desi, and we showed Chloe, and both of them have their all champion titles. So, there you have that little sweet banjo. <laughs> He's cute, isn't he? Yeah, he is. <laughs> Okay, you can see how social these puppies are. I mean, they love people, yes. And they have their little baby tea. We give you uh, two different things. Well, we give you a piggy, of course, that won't last that long. And then we also give what is called a pupsicle. You can put water in it, stick it in the freezer, just like for little human babies. Helps them with their little teething time. And, uh, you know, kind of soothes their little gums. Because they go through this. These guys have their teeth in, but they're still going to lose these baby teeth. They'll get more baby teeth. So, these are your purebred poodles. Yep. And now, Desi is not a Casey registered. Mama is. Chloe is. But you'll get United All Breed Papers. Limited registration for all of them. If you want the full registration, you tell me it's extra, and I want to make sure they're going to a good home. So, we put a lot of time into our babies. Okie dokie. Bye bye. <laughs>